We continue our segment for the RGV, showing you a local business that's fighting to keep its doors open. CBS 4's Clara Benitez introduces us to the Blue Onion. Thin crust, Neapolitan style pizzas. We smoke all of our own meat. We do um, tons of fresh salads and soups every day. It's one of Wessico's hidden treasures. We just started going through colors and we came up with the Blue Onion. It's as simple as that. Yeah. The Blue Onion has called the Rio Grande Valley home for over 20 years. Last year was our best year ever. Owner Gary Anselin will never forget where they first started. 1,500 square feet and 10 tables. Now in a location double the size. Anselin says he never expected for his chairs to be upside down for so long. Ever experienced anything like this before? No, this is completely new. No one has experienced anything like this. No one in our lifetime that I know. When dining halls close, Anselin says he let go of more than half of his staff. It was horrible. It was horrible. But says he hopes to bring everyone back and has already applied for the federal loan to help small businesses. Right now we have our fingers crossed and uh, we're going to see what happens. But right now we're just in survival mode. That's what we're doing. Surviving through drive through and delivery service apps. Uber Eats, Favor, DoorDash, Postmates, Bite Squad. But the Westlake restaurant hasn't just been serving pizza and wraps to the local community. They hope to also serve hope in a student's future, setting up a scholarship fund for one student at both Wessico High Schools. The idea was to pick out kids that, that worked in the restaurant industry um, that maybe didn't have um, scholarships or opportunities to go to um, do something else. So next time you're trying to pick a place to support during these hard times, make sure to check out the Blue Onion. Reporting in Wessico with Complete Valley coverage, Clara Benitez is CBS4 Valley at 10. I like that message like there it. at the end. <laughs> you like that one too, Jim? Oh, that's, pretty that's pretty good. All right, well, the Blue Onion still hopes to pick two scholarship winners and increase the amount to $2,000 each. They're located on International Boulevard in Weslaco and 10th and Dove in McAllen.